I think that here we need to say like... Blakely Buchanan has been fielding a lot of questions about guacamole lately. Yeah. She's the OU Daily's editor-in-chief. When artist Jack White announced that he was coming to perform at OU, she and assistant life and arts editor Emily Sharp started writing. We wrote a story about it just because students are interested in that. They want to know what is, what is the person who's coming to campus asking about? What is, he, what is he like? What is he interested in? Through the state's Open Records Act, they got White's performance contract that comes with what's known as the writer. It's the requirements for the artist on stage and in his dressing room. This one included a specific recipe for guacamole, among other things. Other than that, it really wasn't much to the pair. At first, we thought that it was just a little interesting thing, you know, about th this stuff was included in the writer. Um, but then it became a bigger issue because we suddenly realized, based on the dialogue that our readers were having with us, based on our Twitter uh, mentions and our Facebook comments and things like that, that this became an issue of public information. While interest peaked and web traffic spiked, White was upset addressing the flap in his concert. But then it blew up. White's booking group now says it will boycott OU until state law is changed so the contracts can't be released. Reaction from across the nation has been mixed from jokes about the guac recipe to anger that the contract shouldn't have been published in the first place. We've gotten a lot of support and a lot of criticism from a lot of different people. For Sharp, who's a freshman, and Buchanan, who's a senior, it's been a hands-on learning experience that can't be taught in a classroom lecture. For a minute, Buchanan questioned a purpose. But in the newsroom, this sign she sees every time she walks out the door explains everything. This is important. We need these open records. And this situation is just a microcosm of some of the larger issues we have with transparency.